On this episode, we're talking about our favorite bass players. The Killer's comic book. And aliens. In space. In space, of course. Hey guys, this is Ask Calibris. I am Davey. That is Jimmy. Oh. <laughs> episode 20. Six. Twenty-three. Twenty-three, <laughs> that's right. Uh, you guys sent your questions in. Now it's time to answer them. There you go. Yo, Jimmy, who are some of your favorite bass players? Ooh, thank you. Thanks for asking. I am a bass player. I do play bass, so I do enjoy <laughs> listening to other bass players. And uh, I know people like to make fun of bass players, but... Uh, and drummers. Yeah, and drummers. Whatever, you know, that's great. <laughs> Um, but my favorite. Okay, let's do the top five. Oh, okay. That's Number one. All right. Always Blasco, Blasco, whatever the fuck you, you call yourself now. Rob Zombie, Help Billy Deluxe. He was on that one. Loved the bass on that. Ooh, good. He's Ozzy too. Oh yeah, he plays for Ozzy too. Yeah. The uh, love Ozzy, by the way, FYI. Number two. Sean Yeltz. Is that how you say her name? Yeltz, I don't know. Yeltz, Yeltz. Yeltz, Yeltz. <laughs> Number two. Loved her in White Zombie. Awesome. Awesome stuff. I uh, used to have her picture up in my bedroom. Whoa. A, yeah. <laughs> Do you uh, remember where magazine came from? Uh, Maybe I could find it on the internet. Oh, I don't know. Is Jeez. it metal? Actually, I think I still Heavy have that. Metal. Oh, you still have the photo? I still have it somewhere. Woo! <laughs> put in between some paperwork. Uh, number three. Mm. Yeah, who was it? Oh my god, oh my god. Number three. Metallica. Oh, there it is, Cliff Burton. Cliff Burton. Hey, he oh, knows. Oh, hey! <laughs> <laughs> number four. The man. Oh, who yeah, almost, yeah, 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 yeah. Who almost. Oh, uh, we're gonna get sued for oh, doing shit. that. Oh shit! Oh yeah, I heard about that too. <laughs> uh, so Gene Simmons, uh, uh, my uh, man, uh, uh, my money man, <laughs> bass player Gene. extraordinaire, trying to copyright everything and anything under the sun. He said he did it himself. I don't know. Everyone knows Dio, right? I don't know. Dio said he learned that from his mom. One of these. Yeah, and like they're like gypsies or something. It's a gypsy curse, man. But um, and number five. This, that was number five. Or was it four? I don't know. That's all I got. Those okay. are my favorite. Well, I'm not a bass player, and that, that question wasn't for me, but I got some answers. Oh, yeah? <laughs> what do you got? <laughs> uh, numero uno. You. Oh, what a, what a <laughs> For real. Have you heard his bass playing? Like, holy shit. Like, I listen to our music sometimes. <laughs> And what it's incredible. Oh, thank you. <laughs> the, um, how was that one where you're doing like a... It's a spicy American, meatball. Uh, uh, off more scorpion touch where we go. You make me blush. And then you're like... Doo -doo 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 -doo. You make me blush. What was that? Um, you love it because... I Ride Alone. Yeah. I Ride Alone, that one. Play it. Play it. <laughs> love it. <laughs> and I get to reap the benefits. <laughs> Thanks, uh, I also like um, me, the Muse. The Muse has some sick ass oh, bass, yeah. bass lines. Oh yeah, that's my number three. <laughs> I don't know that guy's Muse name. Muse bass lines. The Muse bass man. And is good. Um, fucking good. R Robbie, Robbie kills, aka Robbie Kirkham. You know who you are, Mister Underhill. Oh, Mister. AKA Nimvin. Oh, yeah. Um, the brother, the, our Canadian. Duplegangers. Yeah, Doppelgangers, dude. Uh, FYI, Mr. Underhill, big influence on Calabrese back in the day when we were forming. We did, it just happened him. to be. Yeah, I think it, it was uh, MP3 MP3 dig, yeah. mp3.com. He found him, right? I found him. We were, we were just forming the band. I'm like, hey, guys, check this out. And you know, I, was, I thought, yeah, these sound pretty good. And then played it for them, and then they went, 
ape shit over it, and then <laughs> just like, wait, that's mine. <laughs> Come back with my music. But well, um, heavy. Everyone knows we love the Misfits. Heavy influence. Okay, we are 138. We also are big Mr. Underhill fans. Nimbind. Yeah. yeah. Still around. Yo, Nimmy out there. Oh, I forgot Hunter, too, AFI. There you go. Okay, okay. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Oh, uh, people are bringing up uh, about the uh, hmm. under And AFI. I guess the... Lemmy. He's oh, yeah, good. I guess. <laughs> Lemmy's pretty good. There's a lot of bass players. Um. <laughs> oh, yeah, Lemmy. Mm. Kind of forget that he does that because he's normally singing. Yeah. He's just singing. Jerry. Oh, yeah, Jerry. <laughs> Jerry's pretty good. <laughs> Mr. Jerry. Coffee. More. <laughs> More distortion. <laughs> oh, what other thing? Wow, there's a lot of... The... I don't know what the fuck I was saying, but... Something there. Kip Space Winger. Players. What the hell is that? <laughs> <laughs> Who the hell's Kip Winger? <laughs> you don't want to... Oh, shit, dude. <laughs> um... Oh, and... Peter Steele. Oh yeah, he did that too. Peter Steele, <laughs> pretty good he, bass player. You he's a bass player too. <laughs> Shit, dude. Oh my god. All right, you're gonna crucify me. Bass player for the Ramones. Which which Ramon was it? Ramon. <laughs> the Ramon, Ramon. Um, fuck. I knew this. <laughs> okay, take back. There's more than five. <laughs> um. Damn! Ugh. Sorry. Sorry, Muntz fans. Dee Dee. Dee Dee's the bass player. Dee Dee's the bass player, right? Because Johnny's a guitar. You know. Okay. Who's the drummer? There's a lot of them. <laughs> Soul surviving. Uh, Tommy was one of them, right? Yep. Anyways. That's good. <laughs> yeah. Uh, who else? Um, wings. Beatles. Oh yeah, dude. That is. That is. <laughs> Paul McCartney. Paul McCartney. There we go, Brady. <laughs> Fuck, dude. Wings. Wings. Is Paul that... McCartney. Sir Paul. Sir Paul, Paul McCartney. McCartney. Sorry. Sorry, you're Um. Yeah. Want to move on? Yeah. Right, yeah I guess we could name a lot of bass players. There's a lot of bass players out there. Yeah. yeah. Okay, they're not, not so bad, huh? Yeah. Take that bass play memes. <laughs> Straight from the Calabrese universe, Spook Show Records presents Dayglow Necros in fully non-posable action figure form. Featuring Purple Death Cape. Torn clothing for the full explosion experience. Battle ready vampire steak. Pulled straight from the heart of Dayglow himself. But wait! There's more! With each purchase, you will receive five limited edition postcards and one badass poster! You will also receive a spooky, one-of-a-kind Dayglow Necros pin. A true introductory piece into the Dayglow Necros gang. This could all be yours for the low, low price of money. Order online today and get your very own Dayglow Necros. Dayglow Necros, new from the Calabrese collection. I sent Davey and Jimmy a cover video on Facebook. Will they see it? Well, I have seen it. Have you seen it? I've not seen it, let's check it out. Let's, let's pop it up. Let's do it. <laughs> All right, this better be good. <laughs> Version of the Calabrese. Um, Calabrese is the dead don't rise. Okay. She sings the whole thing. Oh, did you want to watch the whole thing? A cappella? Yeah. I was expecting a guitar. I like that. I feel like I'm in church. <laughs> Very emotional. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
Okay, yeah, bravo, bravo. Ah, thank you. Thanks for pointing that out. That was... Very good. Um, yes, we did. To answer your question... Now, yeah. <laughs> that was from Carmen. To answer your question, Carmen, yes, we did watch it. Thank you. He's like, That's great. In the face of messages, I did a cover for you guys. It's a work in progress, and you inspire me. By far my favorite band. Well... Thank you very much. Well, thank you. You inspire us. That's incredible. It's I like I like uh, hearing covers like that because it's uh, female singing are mainly songs <laughs> <laughs> instead of dude singing. It's a chick. It's, yeah. Yeah, it's very nice. Uh, fan art is very accepted in the Calabrese world and universe. We love it. We appreciate it. We feed off it. <laughs> yeah. As you can see Love in the it. band room, yeah. we've got, we don't, you know, a lot of bands will just take the fan art and crumple it up. And, <laughs> <laughs> but that's not us. No, 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 no. no, no. no, no. We'll it. put it on the wall so we'll, while we're playing, we'll look over. Feed the energy. Yeah, feed the energy. We hate looking For at real? each other. <laughs> so we're like, I'm going to read what's on the wall, and I'd rather do that than be here. And uh, We got yeah. a lot. Uh, right here, but then there's speckled across the room. There's other arts and letters. We get letters from you guys too. Uh, yeah, and a lot of a lot of lot. gifts too. We appreciate a lot it. Of we gifts. appreciate everything you guys yeah, sent us. A whole bunch of stuff yeah. from you guys back there. So thank you. Thank you. Oh yeah, if it's if it's a physical a fan art, and we get it from you guys on tour. You send it in. It's most likely going to end up there, back here. You know. You got a favorite? Oh, oh shit, oh. boy. This one, what, what's this kid's name? He was he asking if we even have it still. Hell this yeah, guy, motherfucker. We've got it. It's dusty as fuck, because it's old. <laughs> 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 it's the been kid, there for a while. Wood, wood crafting. This, this, this guy, kid, Jeez. man now. He was He's in man now. New Mech, uh, yeah. El Paso. El Paso. El Paso. That's right. What else we got there? Oh, go, grab those like clay things. Those are sick. See this thing? A bat and a zombie. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah, Shit, yeah dude. Bat, zombie, maybe one of them photos. So we got this, too. It's sick AF, man. Look at this fucking shit. Look at that. Dusty and... Uh. Yeah, dude. We've had this for a while. This came from um, Chicago. We're in Chicago. Came to the show. This. Great show. Oh, yeah, dude. Oh, you're out there. I know you're watching. Check it out. We still got it. Hell yeah, dude. This is from... Wendy, dude. Was it Wendy? Wendy. Okay, I believe you. <laughs> Wendy 13, man. Wendy 13, did she put her name on this? I'm not sure. I don't know if this guy did either. No, that's Wendy. This stuff is sick. Little known fact, we have played tambourine live on stage and broken into many tambourines. Yeah, uh, we, we used to do some uh, acoustic shows and what happened? I needed a tambourine to practice on that. Oh, here oh, we go. This is a double photo. Whoa, whoa. Shit, dude. Shane, I know you're out there. Hell yeah, dude. Multiple times. Shane Minor. And we know your names. Yeah, dude. I can't remember the other guy's name, but. Brando, man. <laughs> your friend that came with you guys. Oh, shit. Um, oh, there's so much. Oh my god, okay, we, we could, we, there's so many fan arts that we could do a whole video of just like gushing about how creative you guys are and, uh, and, and dedicated and, and, and um, just like, we just fucking love it. So it, someone ask about this and then we'll, we'll do a video on it. But yeah. no one asked, no one asked it. No one asked yet. Prod it, ask. <laughs> Maybe we'll do one. But yeah, that's just a little piece of, um. Our, what do we call that? The throne? Not the throne, the, uh, our altar. Yeah. Calories altar. We've got, someone made us a Ouija board. Hell yeah. Um, yeah, someone ask. We'll, we'll let, love the show, yeah. And then what we can remember about it and oh, yeah. who they are. And if it's you who did that 
Let us know. Let us know, and then we'll, we can write your name on the back and be like, oh, okay. <laughs> okay. A lot of times, it was someone was handed to us, and it'd be awesome, and then we forget, as you can see. But yeah, we're so grateful for it because it means so much. And you know, if it wasn't for you guys, we'd just be playing music in the basement, in the garage. Mm -hmm. It'd be lonely here at Calabrese Manor. <laughs> weren't for you little people. <laughs> no, no, no. We appreciate you guys. Yeah, the Calabrese Army. You're one of us. That's right. Um, enough gushing. We'll gush later. Yeah. Try yeah. to be yourself. You're one of us. <laughs> when will we see Brett. Calabrese Comic Issue 2? Cool. Thanks, Brett. Um, well, we should let them know if they don't know. We have our own comic book. Issue number yeah, one out one. right now on comic book stands, a.k.a. the digital, a.k.a. ourselves online on the calibrestore.com. <laughs> <laughs> and that's where you can find it. <laughs> all right, so here's the deal. Yeah, all right. Let them know. Okay, we could take this. We could, number two, it's written. We've got Eric Esquivel wrote the second issue of it. It is done. That's We've right. got Andrew Barr, who has started preliminary pencils. It is done. We don't have the money to <laughs> complete it. Yeah. So that's where you come in. Uh -huh. We could take this to Kickstarter. We could take it to crowdfunding. We could take it to something else. But no, what we're going to do, we're going to take it right to you, to the fans. We don't want anyone else to be a part of it, but me and you, us and you, us together. So what we did, we put the issue number one on sale at the Calabrese store and all that money, we're not going to keep any of that money, no. It's all going into a fund to fund the next issue. So if we could sell out of that, we've calculated it, we ran the numbers, we did the uh, calculations, and from what the supercomputer tells us, mm -hmm. if we sell out of all those comics, we will have enough money that's put into the fund, because it's yes. going right into it's the... For it, yes. Yeah, it's going right into the comic, because we're just reinvesting in this thing called Calabrese and once that sells out the next issue we'll have the money we'll have the money we'll have the funds and it's called funding a comic book the old-fashioned way by getting the money up front and doing it yeah um, so yeah like do you do you guys even want number two I know Brett wants number two. yeah Brett, I assume <laughs> we're just um, asking if you want to let us know in the comments yeah. Let us know uh, if you got it. Let us know what you think of it. That's number one. Uh, what do you think of number one? Um, but yeah, number one is just like, how do you describe that? How do you describe number one? Number one, it's Calabrese. Yeah, rock and roll explosion. Blackmailed. Yeah, or blackmailed black by the government to do its dirty work. Mm -hmm. Same old story, same old story. <laughs> so not far from the truth. The, um, it's, you know, for, what was the acronym for rock? rock or something? Something Occult Crimes and Killings. Yeah. I remember that. Read the comic book. Yeah. Buy, buy, buy if you're number one. It's Why signed. Not? It's signed, too. Right now it's signed. signed. You can get it signed uh, by all three of us. Myself, Jimmy, and Bobby. Um, yeah, and number two, dude. Dude, let's divulge a little bit. Since we, Jimmy just mentioned that we do have some of the pencils and a little bit of the inking done. Ooh. Uh, Andrew's been working away. Andrew! Andrew um. Barr! <laughs> Side note, Andrew Barr's been with us since the beginning of the band. Beginning of time. He did the first artwork for us. Second. Second albums. artwork, 1300. Yeah. First full album. First t shirt. Design. First t shirt. Creator of The Bride. Yeah. The unofficial mascot. No offense, Daigle. <laughs> Daigle has become the second mascot. But uh, you guys just love green, green people. So, but anyways, um, yeah, number two, it continues the story, of course. And just shit happens, you know? Like, uh, we're in the mansion, chilling. Something happened previously in the last comic and we have to we have to
take matters into our own hands and fucking get shit done and save somebody. You will know if you read the first comic book. <laughs> um, but yeah, laughs, goofs, graphs, taffs. Uh, it's all fun, yeah, fun and games. You know, it's, uh, a, it's little a little bit of horror, a little bit. You could probably say it's like a mixture of Evil Dead, Hellboy. Uh, I don't know what else is there. All the things that you like. If you like it, right oh, uh, X, maybe a little bit of X Men action in there because the mansion deal, you know. Um, yeah, you know we're big fans of the comics and pop culture, so uh, you know it's gonna be good. But um, yeah. Next question. Tony Lopez. Hey, Tony. <laughs> Tony, little Tony. Like little Tony. Chosen. Hey, guys. I have a question for you. Are any of you interested in science? Science! If so, what scientific topic interests you the most? <laughs> hey, Tony, I didn't know you are a nerd. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> no. Nerds uh, are cool, dude. Nerds are cool. Uh, you know, I fancy myself a part-time nerd. Not only a horror nerd, but I love the outer space. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm a huge, huge fan of NASA and Aliens. space program and the obvious alien invasion that already happened. And um, ancient aliens, dude. The ancient alien. The ancient <laughs> aliens. <laughs> um, yeah, I love, I love all that. Just, just wow. the whole concept of you know black holes and. You might, you know, you might find some of it uh, references in the lyrics to some of the oh, stuff. Yeah. Um, uh, black holes and uh, but, uh, pyramids yeah. and shit. NASA, man, all the way. Or, I should say, go um, SpaceX, take us to the moon and beyond. The uh, independent, independently funded space program. Uh, that, that's awesome. But. Uh, I personally don't want to go into space, but I just think it's awesome that, uh, you know. Coverage in space! It's the final frontier. <laughs> it's badass. Okay, here's, here's a theory. It's like, you know, you're Christopher Columbus, and you think, you know, you're going you're gonna to drive your boat over the edge of the world. But no, you find a new land, and that's what we're going to do. Like, we, we feel like we're the only ones in the universe, but it's just right over the... Uh, I don't know, into the next galaxy if we can figure out how to get there. I'm assuming someone's already been here already. And, um, oh, here. Oh. Yeah. The secret space program. I know you're watching. Confirmed! <laughs> Confirmed! <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, space, all that. Love it. Um, yeah. But, you know, if, all, if we could just go to the other side of the moon, then we can go on to the moon base and take it from there. Yeah. Aliens, aliens, dudes. Uh, our 20 minute answer it's aliens in space. space. Yeah. All right, all right, black and white style, y'all. It's the end of the video. If you've been here before, you know exactly what's gonna happen. But I um, just wanna let you know that we appreciate you, love you, and. Uh, we're glad you guys commenting, interacting, asking, um, liking, subscribing, etc. Uh, you know, if you're new, subscribe and uh, share if you like. Blah 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 blah. Now we got a question for you guys. We want to know some stuff about you guys. So here's a question for you: Who's your favorite bass player? I know it's me, but we want to hear who else you like. And I just remembered someone too. Yeah, Erie Vaughn. Whoa! That's where you got a uh, name dropping and name story. Drop. Got this shirt from the man himself. Directly from Erivan. This is the bootleg <laughs> that he got from someone else and he gave it to us because we helped him out at his art project slash uh, art convention or what, what would you call it? Art gallery of sorts. Yes. But it was a great time. It was yeah. a great. Someone asked about that. We'll tell you all about it. Yeah, that's another story. And uh, <laughs> yeah, I like Eri too, dude. Danzig, Cornhole Danzig, and any, every video we do, Cornhole Danzig and everything, dude. Danzig! Danzig. <laughs> but, um. Call me! Yeah. Um, yo, who's your favorite bass player? Yeah, is it yeah, Jimmy? It. It's cool if it's Jimmy. That's cool. Is it it's yourself? Cool. Is it yourself? Ooh. Uh, you like you like Cliff Burton, you like Erie, you like, um. Peter you Steele? You like Gene, you like Peter, you like, um. 
What else we name off? You like all them bass players? <laughs> you like Flea? <laughs> oh yeah! <laughs> Woo! New single out, love that. Have you heard it? No. It's really cool. Groovy, dude. But, um... Oh yeah, and Lemmy. I know you guys want. Uh... Who are we forgetting? I know there's more killer bass players. <laughs> Remind us! Yeah, remind us, dude. We, we're <laughs> sitting around just thinking of, oh yeah, yeah, oh yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, the name oh, of school embarrassing. from Ghost. The yeah. name of school. But, um, yeah, yep. you want to know uh, what you guys are into. Thanks for watching. See you next time.